September 13th, 2023. Happy Wednesday to all. Uh, followers of this channel know that we alternate between iron cardio on Wednesdays with the Total Tension Complex, both from Strong First. Um, and so for today, we used one 70 pound kettlebell. Um, we utilized that 70 pound kettlebell to do one clean, one press, one squat on the right side. And that is designated by one mark on the board there. Place the bell down to the floor. You should be able to have a talk test. You could be able to communicate with anyone as you're moving through this. It's not a red line effort. I choose to go no higher than 155 for a heart rate response. You have to figure that out for yourself. Uh, essentially, again, it's a, an intensity on a one to 10, 10 being all out exertion, one a walk in the park. It should put you at like a five, maybe a six, all right? So it's not a red liner. Um, all, all this is to say that I marked off every time I did a clean press squat. Um, and at the 10 minute mark, I put a, a vertical line there just to designate and validate if I can do the same amount of reps on the first 10 minutes and the last 10 minutes. Um, I missed it by one. So that's a pretty good indication of muscular endurance, uh, cardiovascular endurance. Um, if I was going at 80 pounds or 90 pounds or 100 pounds, you would maybe see a, a greater variance between those first 10 minutes and that last 10 minutes, okay? So just keep track of those numbers if that means something to you. On the back end, after 20 minutes of the iron cardio, uh, we did a pull-up endurance, dip endurance set, where on 30 seconds, you execute three pull-ups, all right? If you do those in 10 seconds, you have 20 seconds rest. You then go and do two dips, again, on 30 seconds. If it takes you 10 seconds, you have 20 seconds rest. You'll notice I'm designating each one of those here on the board here. So uh, you do a pull-up of three reps, mark that off. You do a dip uh, of two, again, all on 30 seconds. I try to ramp up a bit by then going four reps on the pull-up, again, marking it off on the board, and then ramping up by one rep on the dip as well for three. So you're just going back and forth, back and forth, all right? So pull up for three, you then would then do a dip of two, you would then do a pull up of four, you would then a dip, do a dip of three. Again, these are all on 30 seconds. It ends up being about 35 pull ups, 22 dips in about 10 minutes there. All right, folks, have a great day. Happy hump day.